And welcome, 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 ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Michaela Loves Gymnastics. How are you guys doing today? Um, happy Pride Month, everybody. It's the first day of the beginning of Pride, so that's exciting. Um, but we're going to talk about that in, in another video later to come today. This first video is breaking news, breaking news. Riley is only doing bars at National. I repeat, Riley McCusker is only doing bars at Nationals. How do we all feel about this? How does this um, affect her chances of making this Olympic team? <sighs> is the fact that she's only ready to do bars this late in the game kind of take her out of contention for the main team and only kind of puts her in a specialist role. How do you guys feel about this? I personally feel like um, this does hurt her chances of making the main team. You know, you can't help it if you're hurt. You know, you, you just can't help what um, nature intends. Ooh. Or being ghetto and patting my weave. Oh, I'm so sorry. So, um, so I don't think it hurts her chances of making the Olympics, period. But making the team, the, the four girls to make the team, it really hurts a lot. I do think with her, she's being smart, though. She, she still wants to make the team, so she still knows there's one individual spot left. So she's going for that. So she's going for bars. Probably being. She's probably going to add being towards trials. Competition. Um, Riley, you have to hit the bars to your life, girl. Like, you have to be able to score in the 15 some bars for this to make sense. So I wish you all the luck in the world. Um, and if I get any more information on this Riley McCusker situation, I'll be back with another video. Thank you.